Hello, Brown Middle School, where every student counts and every moment matters. These are your weekly announcements for the week of September 14th, 2020, and we are doing something new this year. Usually you have to listen to me drone on and on about the announcements, but this year the leadership officers are going to be helping me out. They're going to be doing different segments of the announcements and giving you a lot more information. So let's get started with your class president, Cami Carmine, with today's news. Hi Panthers, it's Kimmy Carmine, your class president with the school news. Your 30 minute classes will start at 9.30 a.m. So wake up early. And in between your classes is 15 minutes to chillax. Mondays, Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Fridays you have four core classes. ELA, Social Studies, Science, and Math. On Wednesdays you'll have two classes, your elective class and PE. You'll have no more than 15 minutes of homework per class each day. Composition notebook on sale today. Great for ELA, science, and even math. Found at a store near you. From two to three, you'll have time to work on any schoolwork that you didn't get finished. During distance learning, meals will be delivered by regional bus routes Monday through Friday on school days. To find the location and time of your meal, look at the My Bus Route Student Lookup Tool on Brown Middle School's website. In addition, there will be six locations where students can pick up their meals from 10 a.m. to 11 a.m. Murray Brown, Century, Lincoln Street, Pointer, South Meadows, and Evergreen. Now to Jenna Lee with the birthdays. Hey guys, this is Jenna Lee. I am part of your 8th grade officer team at RA Brown Middle School. I would like to wish a big happy birthday to Jaden, Mayla, Olivia, Blake, Aiden, Miguel, Isabel, Trenton, Michael, Caitlin, Nehemiah, and Ailish. I hope all of you have a great day and make sure to stay safe and healthy. Now here is Mr. Stripling with the joke of the week. Time for the dad joke of the week. Here it is. What do you call a dinosaur that is sleeping? Hmm, that's a tough one. Uh, sleeping dinosaur? Nope, a dinosaur. <laughs> that's a good one. Now here's Caitlin with the quote of the week. Hello everyone! This is Caitlin Olson speaking from the 8th grade leadership officer group. Each week I will be reading a quote that can motivate you, inspire you, or help you out. This week's quote is, Every student can learn just not on the same day or in the same way by George Evans. What this quote means to me is there are multiple approaches to learning. Students not only learning in different ways, but different rates. It is important we all recognize that sometimes we need a little more time and attention. Additionally, as human beings, we all need to understand that we all have our off days. Up next is Michaela with Wellness and Weekly Acts of Kindness. Hey guys, this is Michaela, and I'll be presenting you guys' Weekly Acts of Kindness and giving a healthy reminder. Remember, don't be afraid to ask for help when something is confusing, and also please wear a mask when leaving the house. The acts of kindness you can perform this week are checking up on friends or family and seeing how they're doing or giving a compliment to someone. Next is Xavier with This Week in History. What's going on everybody from Brown Middle School? I'm Xavier Garcia and I'm a part of the 8th grade leadership group this year. And I can promise that each and every one of us will try our best to make this year as good as possible. And this is my first announcement. So yeah, basically this my announcement is about week in history. The first day is September 14, 1959. The first man-made object reaches the moon, and it was called Luna 2, which I think is pretty cool, but yeah. Time for the 15th of September in 1940. The Battle of Britain took place, which they used 56 Spitfires and two dogfights, lasting less than an hour, which Britain won. And for the 16th of September, Mexico declared their independence after being ruled by Spain for 300 years. Time for the 17th, 1976. The first space shuttle, the Enterprise, was unveiled for the first time to the public. For the final day of the week, the 18th, the New York Times were founded. And what you know is one of the biggest uh, news companies that, in the world right now. So yeah, thanks for listening. Have a great day. Good morning, students at Brown. I am Brooklyn, an officer at BMS, and I hope you're all staying healthy and safe. This year, I'm going to be talking about like what happened this week or what's going on this week in the world and the weather. So to start off this week, 
the football teams, college, and the NFL, their season is starting soon. The teams have all decided like different things. Like some are just deciding that there should be like no fans, but some have decided that fans can come back, but they are taking very strict precautions about what they can and can't do. COVID-19, an update on that, there are about 28 million cases in the entire world, which is a lot. So make sure you're wearing your mask and washing your hands and staying at home. And wildfires in Oregon and California around the West Coast, some scientists say it could be one of the most destructive fires in history. On a happier note, Dynamite by BTS has hit number one on the Billboard charts. You should go listen to it, it's a pretty good song. And for the weather this week, it looks like we're gonna have a pretty warm week, like seven in the mid 70s. And It might not be particularly sunny because of the smoke, but it will probably be warm. Have a great first week of school. Here is Alana with your Brain Teaser of the Day. Greetings and salutations, Ari Brown Middle School. This is Alana speaking from this year's eighth grade leadership officer group. I will be in charge of presenting your weekly brain teasers. Each week, as a part of the announcements, we have a brain teaser for you guys to solve. But the following week, we will reveal the answer from the previous week. Just have fun. As each week goes on, it can get progressively harder. For those who are unaware, brain teasers are basically just like riddles. Without further ado, here's your first weekly brain tease. What five-letter word becomes shorter when you add two letters to it? Now here's Annika with this week's spirit challenge. My name is Annika, and I'm here to let you know what our spirit challenges are. We'll be starting off the challenges for this year by showing off our BMS Pride. Wear yellow, black, or other articles of clothing that show your school spirit, and don't forget to send in pictures. All right there, to participate in this challenge, you simply dress up as crazy as you can, put on your spirit gear, and then send me a picture of it at striplm at hsd.k12.org.us. Winning prize, the most outrageous outfit, will get the Dutch Bros gift card. Well, that's all for this week. Hope you had fun. Have a great day, Panthers. See you next time.